I need to do this right now. So, I'll catch you on the flip side. <laughs> All right, now I'm still packing. Actually, I haven't started yet. I'm not gonna lie, this is my third cup of coffee. Oh, it's been a long morning already. Woo, okay. I know I need to do this now. Country number six. I'm coming for ya. where we see half the people leave. And Nana shows up. Right. <laughs> so good to see you, man. Move this back, find me, right? So, first and foremost, how is South Africa? South Africa was pretty good. And I really missed you guys too. I can not stand it. Yeah, Andy got a hat. It's like Indiana Jones. <laughs> we call him Andy Anna Jones. Anna Jones. <laughs> Most of our ministry was in uh, the squatter camps. Okay. Squatter camps is just... 350,000 people crammed in a two mile radius. Wow. Yeah, so they just live on top of each other. There's a lot of poverty, like 80% of the population have AIDS, uh, uh, has HIV. Okay, it's yeah. yeah. just different. So you stayed with the Gap Squad? I stayed with the Gap Squad. How was that? It was, it was not half bad. It was actually very, very good. Yeah, it was just a bunch of young people like finding their way and actually going for it. That's awesome. Yeah. It's really cool. Yeah. What if you could narrow down the one thing you want in the month, what would it be? Uh probably that there's no excuse. Uh, that's just that just popped into my mind right now, but probably that like no excuses. That's awesome. So this next month is our man and spring month which means all 10 dudes, we are in new ministry together. And I think that's going to be a big point that we're going to work on. No excuses, play like a champion, yeah. put your all into it. And with that, I'll introduce you to the guys. Nano, Costa Rica, he's a mohawk. It's awesome. This shirt is Caleb, Caleb's shirt. I got it from the free table. It smells a little bit, but it's all right. It's dry fit and all. A good collar. I like it. Woo! This is Andy. I'm afraid that you get an opportunity to work like this with all men in the mission field. So what do you look forward to the most? Very true. I don't know. A group of guys that you can be real with. Ethan. What's up? <laughs> what are you looking forward to most about working with a bunch of guys? Uh, camaraderie of it. Josh Garcia. Everybody? Hello. What am I looking forward to? Uh, I guess vulnerability? Oh shoot. That's a hard word. Box house. Yes. What are you looking forward to most about working with all dudes on the squad? Um, you know someone else asked me that today and I told him I, I don't know man. I, I think it's just going to be a lot simpler. Women yes. That's true though. You never did that on the race. They never did that. We all know I do my own laundry. Thank you very much. <laughs> um I am just excited to this is one thing that I wanted ever since I found out that this is something that the world race does. Alright, so it's what? It's raining, first and foremost. Okay. We were supposed to be where we were supposed to be at 2 p.m. It's now somewhere close to 7.30. This is what happens in Africa. Things get delayed for no reason. We're here to rest up. Probably gonna eat something. To be honest, I don't know how much longer we have to go. Here we go. So we have like, I don't know, like five hours left in this drive. This was supposed to be a nice, easy travel day, but you know, things at the border and waiting and then rain and then driving. And now we're gonna end up sleeping on this thing. It's not the world race till you sleep on the bus. 
such a we have bus scenario. Anyone who watched it. Is that a real scenario? Yeah, they used to have a school bus, like a scenario where you slept on a school bus, and then they got rid of it. And now I'm not prepared. I'm scared. <laughs> what? Uh, you have your sleep. Yeah, uh, Mr. Club. Uh, it's me, Bernie, sir. So we've arrived at the place we're gonna stay tonight. <laughs> you mean our bus? <laughs> well, we're stopped in a parking lot. I'm gonna continue to read Harry Potter. I'm on book six, so. In the thick of it right now. So I'm gonna keep reading. I'll see you in the morning. So we officially arrived at a destination here in Lusaka. I have no idea what's going on, but we're leaving that bus. So the girls already left. So now we're getting this van. How long is this trip gonna be? Eight hours. Hopefully two. One hour. Oh, hopefully one Never. hour. Let's just say one hour. It might be five hours hopefully or seven. You never know. I do need to get a ATM so that as a group we have money. I like that idea. <laughs> or you could really, you know, just really wing it. Yeah, or just wing no it. Money. We're just gonna be killing stuff and find building our own shelters because you know. Because we're men. <laughs> That's a tight squeeze. No, he wasn't ready. <laughs> hey, African Vision Pope. So now that we visited. A school. Where to go? I think. I think we're gonna go finally make a home for ourselves. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Still going. You think you're talking to yourself, Caleb? I am, for the most part. When did we start this trip? Uh, yesterday. We were supposed to be leaving at 7 a.m. Right. But we actually left at 12:30. 12:30. So we've been going on. 22, 26 hours, 26 long. hours straight. <laughs> Too long. Slept on the bus. The logic is wrong. So uh, we finally landed mm -hmm. in the apartment we're gonna stay in, which is Operate. nice. Operate. There's like an apartment, and then like another house, and another house, and so we're all split up all around. But this will be the main hub of our manly activities, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So we got a mattress. With plastic on it? More plastic. Like, you know you're really in Africa when they got plastic on the mattress. Or you're in the hood. <laughs> That's racist. <laughs> <laughs> on that note, hey, we, I like the video. I'm, I'm from California, so uh, <laughs> there's hood everywhere. Double racist. <laughs> Half my auntie. Subscribe if you want to hear more of Josh's comments. <laughs> and, or not, that's cool too. Yeah, All right. You do what you do. I'll catch you later. See you on the flip side.